Eric, such a pleasure to speak with you. The film is hilarious. So what was the biggest challenge in lengthening this from the original skit, which was so funny um, online while keeping it, you know, just as funny because that seems like such a challenge and you pulled it off. <laughs> well, first of all, thank you so much for saying that. Um, yeah, it was, uh, you know, it, it, it was it was challenging stre stretching this out to feature length in that we, you know, it's not like a direct parody of, of any specific biopic. We sort of borrow from, you know, a, a everything from movies like you know, Bohemian Rhapsody, Rocket Man, Walk the Line, um, all the way to, you know, Boogie Nights, Forrest Gump, even like the fictional, uh, 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 fictional biopics. Um, we really wanted to create our own original story and not, you know, follow like a template so much like we wanted to play off biopic tropes but really create a um uh a, like a re refreshing or original story that would surprise people so i think i mean that that was the biggest challenge that we we stray from al's real life so we weren't really um you know it's not like we did i did a bunch of research on like <laughs> on al's actual life there are nuggets of truth in this movie but um but the challenge was really creating an original story for this bizarro movie version of Weird Al. Yeah, definitely nuggets of truth, like Eat It being an original song. Um, so, <laughs> you know, Aaron Paul was so great in the original skit, and he told me he was going to have a cameo, but then he got COVID. Was he going to be at the pool party, or what was he going to do in the film? Um, he was actually going to be another heckler at the... Um... Uh, the the I in the I love Rocky Road scene when they play at the bar the Cobra Pit, um, he was gonna be like a biker. We were gonna give him a big beard and like disguise him as a biker. I, I my my goal I wanted people to see this movie and say like wait a second it, I have to rewind is that Aaron Paul? is that Aaron Paul underneath this biker disguise? Um, but he was gonna be yeah shouting down um, uh, Daniel you know as he came out on stage. Oh, that's real funny. Um and. There are so many amazing cameos and so much comedy royalty in this film. You know, I'm sure a lot of people just wanted to pay tribute to Al and his legacy. But how was it assembling such a cast? Because it's incredible. Uh, yeah, it was pretty it was pretty amazing. Like our main actors when they signed on, you know, Daniel and Evan and, and Rain, um, Julianne, <laughs> Julianne Nicholson, who like had was just coming off an Emmy win for Mayor of Easttown. And what I didn't know at the time was also playing Marilyn Monroe's mother in Blonde. Um, you know, what a palate cleanser this must have been to come in and play uh, Weird Al's mom. Um, but really, for most of our cameos, you know, uh, it, it was friends of Al. I mean, a, a, everyone loves Weird Al, and he's got, um, you know, a, a very robust uh, Rolodex to pull from. So we kind of just, like, listed out all of the uh, friends and acquaintances of his and uh, and just started, like, assigning characters to them. And he reached out personally to a bunch of people. And, um, I mean, it was so fun getting yeses immediately from all of these, like, you know, all this major comedic talent. That's amazing. And, you know, I expected the comedy to be good, but I didn't expect the fight sequences to be so awesome. I was just a total badass. How was it filming this? Uh, I mean, it was amazing. Yeah, he's he's John Wick in a Hawaiian shirt. <laughs> um, it was uh, it was great filming those fight scenes. I mean, we um, you know, luckily we had the uh, the time to rehearse. We, you know, we it, we shot the movie in a in 18 days, which was which was a bit of a challenge. Um but we we got rehearsal time to chore you know choreograph all these uh, all these fight scenes and um, you know Dan Daniel Radcliffe is like doing a lot of the stunt work himself in the fight scenes he he really um, he picked up the fight choreography really well and uh, and yeah we we just got in there fast and furious and and uh, and got it done I'm really happy with how they turned out. <laughs> 